G'day everyone, it is my last day in Bangkok, Thailand for a little bit. I'm going to the Philippines tomorrow, but then I am coming back to Thailand after. But either way, it's the last night here for now. I am leaving for the weekend. So what we're going to do, we're going to head out. It's going to have uh, a bite to eat, a couple of drinks, and I want to show you just a couple of places uh, before I go. Like I said, even though I'm coming back anyway, so I'm going to show you another time. But last night I went out on my own, didn't take the camera, I just went out to have a look. I found a couple of nice spots and we're going there tonight, so let's get it. Okay, I've made it. I'm walking up here now. The place is called Buddy's Bar and Grill. As usual, link in the description, so if you want to come here, you can come straight there with Google Maps. But it's only a small place, two story. Um, but I, I like it because it's a pretty cool vibe in there. And the, the, the menu, the food menu is good for variety. Thai food, you know, Western food, that sort of thing. They've even got tacos on the menu, hot dogs as well. Haven't seen that anywhere else. but. This is it. Let me show you. Oh, what the fuck was that? Like a bit of mystery juice. Fuck. But I'll go out the front. I don't want to get a food like Oh, big dog. Big dog on the cigar out the front. This one. All good. Buddy's Bar and Grill. Looking good. Even inside, it's a fucking... It's nice. Hello, how are you? All right, I've got myself Jack Daniels. Here's the menu as well. This is what I was saying, right? They've got soup, sandwich, salad, just snacks. If you want to get snacks too, I've got a garlic and cheese every night. Honestly, it's terrible. Uh, and then we've got Mexican food, right? And Thai food as well. And other side, boom, it keeps going. We've got burgers, hot dogs, other buddies for a bowl of chili, bowl of chili with melted cheddar cheese, chili cheese fries. And then there's also pizzas on here as well, right? If you want some extras, you, you can do that. But all, all I'm saying is, right, like outside, like I said, before I come in, variety is crazy. I think it's time to order some food. Uh, there was a bloke next to me chatting my ear off, which I don't mind. Um, we actually had a good chat, but I wanted to get this done. So let's do that now. I'm going to go with, um, with some Mexican stuff. So let's see how let's see how they do with that. I'm going to go, I'm thinking just the tacos. Tacos, beef or chicken. 210 baht, so hopefully they get it with like three tacos. Hopefully at least three. We salsa, sour cream, and jalapenos. Jalapenos. <laughs> anyway, but they got, bro, even if you just want some snacks, right? Like, oh shit, like down here, if you just wanted like, so like sriracha buffalo, a couple of buffalo wings, some jalapeno poppers, yeah, onion rings, chicken wings, they got like good snacks, man. So I, I came in here last night, I'd already eaten, but I, I wanted. I'm still hungry, right? So I had a couple of drinks and I got some cheesy garlic bread, which admittedly wasn't the greatest, but it was still good just to sit here, have a nice little snack, cheap price, real good, right? And also, boom, uh, right, the, the Jack Daniel prices here are actually fucking decent, right? Check this out. Uh, let me go through here. Spirits, uh, Jack Daniels with the fucking, with the Coke, 145. 145. Most other places are charging closer to 200. So <laughs> it's actually pretty fucking good. Not gonna lie. So uh, let me go and order these tacos, and I'll see once they come out. Oh, and also while while we're here, right? Um, the the lovely lady behind the bar. Uh, once I rocked up here, she looked at me and she said, uh, "Jack and Coke." Um, yep, she remembered from last night. I mean, that's I mean, it's probably pretty easy to do. But either way, the fact that someone remembered what my order is. If you know, you know. If you go to a bar, even if it's only one time, you go at the next time, they remember what you ordered. That's that's pretty good. They're paying attention. That's, that's good shit. But while there's a few less people in here, what I'll do, look. Oh, look. Oh, check out the vibe. They've got little signs up everywhere, this sort of thing. There's also, this is like an upstairs area there, which I'll show you after. But there's like a pool table, darts, that sort of thing. So if you're into that, you can do it. But even if you want to chill at the bar, this is good. There's people sitting here, so I don't want to get them on camera. But if you want to sit singly at the bar, just watch this. Watch the run, got some footy on that sort of thing, there's some snacks here. Perfect. Boom boom. Alright, they've arrived. Oh, I've got a couple of fucking flavors. Oh, mmm. Mmm, the side. Mmm. 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 Not bad. Oh, these are good, but it's just like, um, I'm not sure if the same brand is in other countries, but in Australia, we're at El Paso, <laughs> right? Which is like you can buy a taco kit. It's the same. It's the same. <laughs> Let me grab one of these again. Mm. You know, I'm fucking around. Mm. It should be zero effect. You think I'm kidding? I'll, I'll raw dog another one. Look, watch this. Mm. Mm. Oh, 
so good. We're smashing it. Oh, we smashed it. We've got a little bit left over. I don't know what to do. Like, I had some of the salsa and one of the other um, tacos, and not gonna. Oh, chocolate cup. Oh, yeah, I had some of the um, had some of the salsa on one of the other tacos, and quite honestly, I don't know how, but it, it tastes like this. So, um, not having any more of the salsa. And there is some sour cream there, but no, whatever, whatever. I'm just gonna scoop up. Look at this. I can push it around there, right? I'm gonna scoop all this up. Have a couple. Have a couple of lines of taco filling. <laughs> that was lovely. Oh, gone. But that doesn't mean they're not good, right? That's it, it, bro. That was still good, and it was three. I was wondering, like, over oh, that price, is it one or two? Three. Bit of salsa, that was not the best. But and sour cream, you can't really fuck that up. We're all good. Bloody beautiful. And also myself another JD because it'd be rude not to. I'm gonna show you the upstairs part here now. There's some people up here all night so they finally left. <laughs> I know like I'm trying to get them to leave but I just, I just want to be, you, you get it right? But anyway look at this right? This is the upstairs area so downstairs I was sitting like just over here but that's what I'm saying the vibe here is fucking sick man. Just the fact, I don't know whatever like the, the signs, the little, they've got hats and everything around it's a it's a certain vibe that you get in, in uh, pubs back home, that sort of thing. If you know, you know. Anyway, we're having a look around. We've got the menus and everything here, right? A few pictures and everything, bit of memorabilia, like I'm saying, right? So probably some older pictures, a couple of the boys. Hey, look at this guy. Hey, fucking. Hey, he used to fucking back in the day, you get me, right? <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> we've got the dartboard here. We've got the official length back. Asah, that's definitely a bullseye or at least a triple 20. Uh, and then we've got the pool table as well. Uh, now the main thing is, that's also that's also pretty cool. F1 over the years, that's pretty cool. Uh, got the dunnies here, right? Um, pinball, that obviously probably doesn't work. Uh, and then we've got the, the pool table. I'm trying to suss out how much the pool is here. I don't know, you gotta put some... You, oh wait, hang on. Oh, there's no glass here. Oh, it's free. Okay, okay. <laughs> I was expecting like glass or like place like perspex or something to be along here so you couldn't get in there, but it's free. You just grab the balls out and away you go. Fuck this thing. Oh yeah, I ain't putting coins in. But look at this, bro. This is actually sick. Oh, and we got this too. So I've got the TV up there, so you got the footy on, dartboard, memorabilia, pool table that's free, uh, pinball that isn't working maybe in the future, I don't know. A couple of seats and everything. Look at this man! Bro, that's this is this is a good place, and plus I showed you the menu before. You got so much stuff, like boom, 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 boom. You turn it over, even more burgers, hot dogs, just nice snacks, pizza. Man, this place is, this place is fucking good, bro. I'm not fucking, I wouldn't, why would I lie to you, right? And then we've also got um, the cheaper Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels, 145, which is, which is decent. Decent price, especially for being in a city, you know what I mean? But anyway, this is the one, beautiful area. Uh, and then you've got like a down, downstairs too, where I've been sitting the entire time. But it's, it is small, don't get me wrong, it's small, so if you come here on a busy night, you, you, you might not even get a seat, okay? But this is a good spot to come, and uh, I, I enjoyed it. I, I enjoyed it. So I'm going to head out of here now and go somewhere else. I think maybe just uh, another, another little bar or something like that, see what's happening. But I can't get too smashed tonight because I literally have to go to the Philippines tomorrow. And I've got to check out of my Airbnb kind of early. So I need to be smart with it, even though I probably won't, but I need to at least try, you get me? All right, we're all finished at that bar. I was just talking to a couple of guys out the front. I seen one dude at the front of that place that uh, lives or was staying at the same accommodation that I was staying at. I was like, hey, what the hell? Like, it's not like we're heaps close, like around the corner. It's like a fair few k's away, but I've seen emails like, yo, brother, hey, what's going on? We had a quick chat about, uh, you know, just about fucking here and things. I told them, I was like, oh, this, this, this little bar has good Thai food, great Thai food. And they said to me, right, they said to me, oh, yeah, but I, I don't like tofu. I, I don't, I don't we, we don't like tofu. I was like, no, 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 Thai food. Oh, like, <laughs> uh, I, I, like, <laughs> I love the fact that even though it's bad, I love the fact that like like different accents like interpret different things differently, like certain words. Like it, it makes me laugh, man. But <clears throat> either way, what we're gonna do now? 
Uh, so for now, what we're going to do, even though you can't really see me, I'm trying to get the good lighting here, we're going to go to a weed store called Adam's Weed Store. They're open 24 hours. 24 hours, apparently. The guy in there, when I went there last night, was really friendly. They've got a PlayStation upstairs. It's a good spot. I'll take you. Let's go. All right, I think about two hours ago, I said I wanted to come here. I eventually made it after doing other things. And not, don't, no. Uh, but I've gone to Adam's Weed, and apparently, according to Google, they are open 24-7. And it's just around the corner from the Hash Salon place from my last video. Literally right here around the corner. Open 24-7. They've got a PlayStation upstairs. No good games, but there's one up there. Um, and the, the, the weed's pretty good. So I'm going to head in, and I'm going to show you. It looks like a different person than yesterday. But I asked yesterday, and they said I could make a video. So I'm popping in. Hello, how are you? Sorry, Cap. Good. Good, thank you. Upstairs here, check this out. This is like the little smoking area. And they've got TV, PlayStation 4. And the best part about this one, right? Open 24 hours. And then you've got snacks. If you want M&M's, chips, you just, you just have it. You just have it, it's free. All right, same as like this fridge here. You come over here, boom. Coke, juice, oh, Milo drink, bro. Juice, but look at it. Hey, you grab it. Oh, and then you come smoke. Put the TV on, Wi-Fi. It's a pretty good spot. Bunch of people in the, the lower lobby there, so I didn't want to record it. There was like about six people in there, so I didn't want to record everything. But uh, Adam's Weed, like I said before, open 24-7. Nice upstairs area. Uh, I need to get back on the scooter and get home. I noticed on the way here that all my blinkers have stopped working, the front and the back all stop working so that's great um so i need to make sure i get home safely because i need to get this thing back to the higher place early in the morning and then get back to my airbnb check out get a taxi to the airport and get on a plane to the philippines so i suppose i'll see you in the morning the next day g'day everyone so we're gonna have a small game of two truths and a lie okay so to start it off my name is wayne Secondly, I made it home safely last night after going to that little spot, right? And thirdly, I'm not a complete idiot and I definitely didn't miss my flight to the Philippines. <laughs> Which one do you think it is? Yeah, I missed my flight. I missed my flight. It's my own fault. I, I accidentally looked at the times for the flight coming back from the Philippines back to Bangkok on Monday. And I, yeah, that's the time I looked at. And by the time I got to the airport, the plane had well and truly left. It left like early in the morning. So... It's my own fault, I'm an idiot. What I've done is I've booked myself another Airbnb uh, in, in Bangkok, so I'll be here over the weekend. Then I've got some more accommodation booked in another part of Bangkok after this weekend, so looks like I'm still in Thailand. But that's all right, because on the way here, I was looking at the taxi as, as I was getting close to where I am now. I was looking at the taxi. There's actually some pretty cool little restaurants and stuff kind of close here, and it looks like there's a lot more little like family-owned restaurants, like real, like tiny ones. So I'm really keen to go try one of those, get the, you know, authentic, you know, experience. Not gonna lie, I'm gonna have a little bit of a rest and then I'm gonna head out soon so I'll talk to you then all right so I've had a bit of a rest I'm gonna head down um, go back to that motorbike place that I hired the last motorbike from and see if they've got the same one or a similar one for me hopefully uh, but we'll see how we go I suppose so I'm gonna get a bike so I've got something to ride around on while I'm here for the next few like a week or so uh, and then probably get something to eat and a drink and that'll be it for this video I've got the bike all sorted Boom boom. He sorted me out a freaking good deal for the few days. Let me take this thing out here. Alright, let's have a quick look at her. Let's make sure we document the condition, you know. A couple of in here. Have a look. A bit of a bit of action on here, a bit of peeling, a couple of scratches, some stuff. Alright, no worries. Just wanted to have a look. And you make sure you do the same if you're hiring on a bike. Pictures, video, whatever you need to do. Um, but for now, it's sorted. I am gonna go get something to eat, I think. I'm gonna head back to the like closer to the hotel. Uh, and go get something to eat there, I reckon. Because this street's wild. That's bloody You know what I mean? It's a you're not a it's a you know what I mean street, right? There's freelancers everywhere and stuff. All right, I've made it back safely. Trusty Steed got me here. Um, I've got the keys. Do I? Well, they're not in there, so I've got the area there somewhere. I haven't lost them again, have I? They're in there. Okay. No, <laughs> Constant battle, boys. There's a buffet thing around the corner there. I'm going to go check that out. And uh, there's also, there's a, literally a weed store, like 
not even 50 metres away. So, bloody, we're on. What a good choice. Uh, they also, they've got beers in the fridge here too. There's like a thing here. Oh, look, they've got chippies. Fucking, oh, they've got fucking rip-off Pringles. Um, beers, whatever you need. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be having those. Tuna mayos. But far out, what's the price on these bad boys here? Singer 45, that's, that's an appropriate price. That's not bad. Plus all your snacks and the weed store down the road. Oh man, they got the they got the munchie fridge ready. And we're off. So I'm probably gonna stop in. There's a, there was a little store just here. So if they're still open, they, they've got the sign out the front. I'm gonna pop in here and say hello. But I was just talking to the security guard, right? At the thing. I, I can I can smoke my cannabis, right? Cannabis. I can smoke it just there. Like at the just come out the front of the hotel, smoke it, no problem. No, no problem. Oh we got this one, look. Shaggy buds, I reckon. Hey? Let's see what the fucking go is. Hey, what a guy. Hello, how are you? All right, we're off again. Had a quick little bargain in there, and now we're gonna get something to eat. Let's gotta cross this road. That's a gap. That's such a gap. Oh, oh boost. Yep, got him. Definitely was. All right, boys. Let's have a look. Oh, that's. It's not even a restaurant. All right. Uh, foot massage? Not a, no, no. Wait, where was the food place? So our swimming pool is open. Oh, we got a fucking swimming pool here. I thought that was the restaurant, not gonna lie. I don't know why. I, I should have walked in there. Uh, oh, here it is. Okay, I knew it was close. Oh, here's one. There's two. Oh, there's two. Another one down here. We'll have a look. So. Oh wait, no, that's the sign for that one. Nah, there's another one. I know there is. I know there is. Hang on. Hang on. I know I seen two. Cause that one was like more seafood or something. I think. Looking good. It looks pretty oh, far out. It looks busy as. All right. I'll see if I can get a a decent table where I'm not sitting there recording everybody in the background, you know, or too many people. But it looks fucking good. Let's go have a look. Yeah, that looks better. That looks heaps better. All right, let's go. a little bit and I'm definitely meant to be doing it myself but the guy 100% feels sorry for me he's seen they have no idea what I'm doing or next to no idea and just started started helping me and yeah, absolute legend like everyone else needs to do it themselves I feel like such a kid like having someone do it for me but I'll take it some of these that one's still going that's why I can tuck into these in a sec, let me sort this out. Get in there, get in the groove, there we go. All right, I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Give me a sec, right, there we go. Bit of an angle, this will work, this will work. Come here. Bust. I got a knife and fork there, but honestly, it was easier to pick these up with the um, choppies, you know? Mm. So good. Cook to perfection, because I didn't do it. I've got this like, this is like a chili sauce. Also a chili. I don't know, it's like a I only say I have no idea. It's not chili. <laughs> Put it that way. But we're going in. Yep. Yep, get covered in it. There we go. Nothing to stop it. The only shit part is right. Uh, I paid for the drink and, and a refill. However, they have a big container of ice, that, but all the drinks are over there, just like on the, um, just on the bench, just like not refrigerated, just warm. You know, so he's gonna hope the ice does all the work. It does, but not, not the best. All right, we're on, on my own now. I've seen how the master does it. Now it's time for the young whippersnapper to, to come up, get the young grasshopper, to, you know. Take the reins to touch. So got some pork, pork belly there. Can't remember what this is. Pork something. It's pork a lot. 
Alrighty, I'm all Dunskis for the night, paid my dues. Tip, of course, because he definitely didn't have to do that for me, so I appreciate that. I'm boosting, far out. I'm so full. I know I didn't get much of the dinner and stuff, but I mean, how much pork and a barbecue do you want to see? But uh, either way, um, I'm probably gonna go home and, and sleep. I was honestly, I was up, I was up really late, but I had to wake up early to go catch my flight that I thought was later this afternoon, but I already missed it, so. I'm pretty tired, not gonna lie. I think I might just go and snooze and I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I'll see you on the next one.